Hi, my name is Kevin from JVH. In this video today, I'm going to show you how to unbox D29A and have an initial setup. It's really simple and easy. Simply just open the top of the cotton by cutting the tap and also the stripe off that we can open up the cotton and then we lay the whole cotton down. It's much easier for us to take out the units. It's really simple and easy. We have already got wheelchair out of cotton. First of all, let's check out. We have several accessories that we have it for initial setup. First of all, is the seat cushion right on the back here, and then seat back cushion right between the wheelchair and also a charger inside the box. We have a controller and also use as a main back. Right here on the storage back, we need to open up the wheelchair in order that we can take out the accessory. Just lift up the backrest because it's a special device for it. When you hear a sound click, it's all set. Then we hold the top of the seat back and then lean the wheelchair to the front. We can open up the wheelchair, it's really simple and easy. Then we zip the storage back, and then we can find out the controller here. And then a user's menu pack with safety belt and some simple tools for you available in the future. Let's set up the seat cushion right on the top of the seat here. And also the seat back cushion, we have the logo to the back. Insert it right between the space here, and then attach it to the seat back here. Final thing is the controller. We find out there is an insert pipe, and then there's a, a pipe under the armrest. We just simply slide it in, and then turn the knob to tight. Then we can connect the connector. You will find Errors on both connector. We match them together, insert them together, and then turn the knob in the middle to tight. We have the connection well set. Wheelchair actually has free wheel mode designed that allow you to have manual or electric control mode switch. Simply, we just turn the lever to the front. We are entering into the manual control mode that allow us to push by hand. If you want to control through electric mode, simply just put two levels on the back here. We are right at electric mode that we can control through electric. Simply we want to access the wheelchair, just turn the lever up. That allows us to flip up the armrest and then we can access from the side. It's really simple or easy. Either you can choose to access from the front too. Battery actually has been charged. We simply just the power on we can start to run the wheelchair to the phone to the back or to both sides right and left even a 360 degree rotation is no problem at all when it comes to charging the battery there are actually two ways for your choice first of all you can choose the joystick controller charge simply just plug in the plug right at the front of the controller here then you can connect to power source for direct charge the second way is the battery charge is the OPPO charge design we just lift up the handlebar battery that we can pull out the battery really simple and easy right at from the battery box that there is a charging post that simply you just connect the connector here and then you can take out the battery either you can take it inside the home or you can take it out to any other places with power source for charging is really convenient to force up the wheelchair is really simple and easy we will find out a knob right on the back of the wheelchair simply just pull the knob out at the same time we push the seat back to the front a little bit we have one hand holds the front of the seat base the other hand holds the top of the seat back we can push them towards the center at the same time we can force up the wheelchair in just a few seconds really simple and easy final thing is the seat back which is foldable we just push the two levers on each side and then turn the seat back down we have the wheelchair folded i hope you find out the initial setup on box of d 29A is very really simple and easy for you. If you got any question, please check out user's menu or you can subscribe to our YouTube channel for further information. Please don't forget to put your thumb up. Thank you very much.